Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Warmer 40k Inquisitor Martyr and we are going on with our uh, investigation and we have to do a decisive purge. It's a small purge, we have to exterminate all enemies. And the mission briefing is as follows. Synchronized Opalus strikes have blinded the command centers of the cultist militia. Collapse is imminent. Purgative measures are hindered by collaterals fleeing from the war zone. Directive The Sacred Slaughter Shell commands archive victory through unwavering faith. And can we all enemies will reduce to 90 health? Nice, you can die plus one time. No, grant it to call in advance. And ah, I'll take the 90% thingy. So, um. I played a little bit in the off um, with a different character and I actually um, encountered a different setting now. It was, you know, the normal space station but or the Imperial complex to be precise there. But what I um, thought it was really cool, it was Nurgle infested. So you've got, you know, all the Nurgly stuff there that looked pretty damn amazing and I would like to show that to you and I hope we are going to find such a setting soonish but as you can see that is a different setting now because it's a little bit darker and I've been talking about the um, about that I have already talked in oh god I think it's um, it's a little, bit, a little bit longer ago that I've seen footage um, of the, you know, before the alpha um, started, I seen some footage where it was really, really dark, you know, um, and it was, you know, before the different um, Imperial Complex settings, um, it was not that dark, and um, they were said they changed it, so it seems like that darkness level right here is actually seems to be um, nearly like the old setting, and I like it. It um, really fits in the dark and grim 40k universe, at least I think that. So it's, it, I think it's fitting here. So I'm taking him out. So let us basically get a little bit out of the focus of all the enemies. Out, we shoot here. It's down as well. Nice. So we have a couple of enemies here remaining, and even more grenades awaiting us. Nice. So I can throw them. Take this dude out before he hopefully can take this. Nice. Before he can actually take his health portion. Got the items going on, a little booster here, and we even got get more crafting ingredients up on the right. And I'm ah, oh, I thought we could go through there, so we have to go all the way back. No, but that is how it just is. So, come on, get oh, nice. So, some. Crafting credits and crafting ingredients. Nice, nice, nice. We really have to um, take a look at crafting as well. Um, I'm playing currently um, with the dual wielding um, pistol Inquisitor background, the salt gunner, and I really, really enjoy it. it you know, I got a plasma pistol and a um, less pistol, and the damage output there is just amazing. It, does they two pistols do so much damage this is incredible I actually um, tried that out before but um, it wasn't um, as good it didn't do as much damage as I actually hoped for so I'm now really surprised that it does do so much damage again so let's get into cover shoot them to pieces just in case so taking them out and going on the next room is up so let us see whether there is a dreadnought or something eh, obviously not all right that one is down a couple of enemies here and we'll kill right now 
So let's get into cover. Oh, there was a little lag, I'm sorry for that. So I get out now, out of cover, taking him out. As well as these guys. So that was a decent nated actually. Get out of harm's way here. Oh, one remains. I'll see him. So, okay, we of course are going to take the inoculators as well, although I guess we already have enough of them. So, that's alright. Going on here. And getting the medical supply. Which we actually not need, but we just take. So 15 inoculators should be well enough to finalize this small purge. So we all only have purged half of the enemies by now. So we have still a little bit work ahead of us. And I've again overseen... Oh, come on. Oh god, I... Every time I oversee those mines, I can't. Should really pay more attention there. Can I actually read it like that? Yes. So, and it's out. At least two are dead. Okay, I don't need to get in there by now. I will keep that for the end. inoculator supply pack nice and even more grenades that's cool so we shall have no troubles here whatsoever so big guy down just a couple of minor guys out. That was a good grenade tip there, I think. So let us aim for the hit. And retreat. So his big hit comes up. Which didn't do any damage because we retreated and that is amazing. So shall it always be. Alright. Taking on the security door. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Before we die. So, a couple of more guys remain. So, one smaller room and then the big last room comes up here. Made out, shoot a little bit and even take some power here. Full throttle out. And he is. And let us go into the last room and let us find out what four enemies we have here. Oh god, I actually hoped for... Honestly, I hoped for a Dreadnought or something like that. To have a smaller little fight here. So, five remain. One more Cyclone Sarancher hit and gone. They are then. Let us take the ingredients and we have completed this step of the investigation. So let us see what is going to come out in the end here. So, oh, we found something blue. Nice flash grenade. Oh, not that nice. Auto pistol, nice. Oh, ooh, a new armor, nice, but that's actually not the one I want to equip. And we found a heavy flamer, which I always wanted to use. Let us see whether we will do that. Operation concluded. 
collaterals fleeing the war zone caused considerable delay in neutralizing the cultist threat parties at fault executed. Um, final words, local officials were, tr were tried and executed en masse for treason for not reporting the cultist threat as soon as it emerged only from death cometh absolution. Well done, failure was never an option. All right, yes, that is true, that is true. That is true. And let us take a look at our character here. We are, well, not, we are on the way to level seven. With that, I will end this episode, guys. I um, really thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Stay frosty. Bye.